This is going to be a video tutorial on how to browse in private mode using the Microsoft Edge browser. I'm going to jump over to Microsoft Edge here. Okay, I'm in Microsoft Edge here. If you want to browse in a more private mode, what you do is you go up to the three dot hamburger menu in the upper right hand corner, click on it, go down to where it says new in private window. Click on that. That opens a new tab in a private browsing mode. If you look down here, what in private browsing does deletes your browsing info when you close all in private windows, saves collections, favorites, and downloads, but not download history, prevents Microsoft Bing searches from being associated with you. This is a good uh, tool to use if you're sharing a computer with somebody, like a family member or something, you could uh, browse in private basically. If you look at this window box over here, what in private browsing doesn't do, hide your browsing from your school, employer, or internet service provider. That means like you're, uh, if you're using a school computer, the school can still see what you're doing. They can remotely go on, same with an employer, they can remotely go on your, on your computer and watch what you're doing. Uh, your internet service provider, of course, can also see where you've where you've been. But this uh, feature here in private browsing, it's mainly for, like, if you're using a home computer and you're sharing it with other people, you can uh, open it in, in private window, and other members of your family can't see what you've been searching for and you know whatnot. But that's how you open up a private window using the Microsoft Edge browser. Thanks for watching.